Dropping that work like a ride. Serving a new Maserati. And a brand new Maserati. That's a whole lot of new money. Session that had it from 12. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Ron Gasso coming at you with another episode of Custom Closet. That's right. We got a new shoe here, a new custom I just finished up. And uh, before we get started to that, I want to give a huge shout out to my boy M. Harvey SK for the oop on this paint. Uh, he actually gave me some information, gave me a little hint and tip. Or actually, just flat out just told me what it was. And this paint is very, very durable. It's uh, flexible and it sticks super, super well on plastic materials. And this is actually something that people use when they customize their RC cars. So like the little um, cars that people race and they have like that plasticky um, material. They use this paint on there to actually make it stick and uh, customize it to any color that they want. Um, and they have, they have different effects like chrome and holographic effects as well. And uh, he gave me the information on it. And uh, let's go ahead and get right into it. We have here a Jordan 11 Concord. I'm not sure if you guys can see it or not the camera picks it up but these do have holographic fakes flakes on the patent leather um, I will be shooting some footage for you guys so you can see outside the car just so you can get a full effect of how good and how bright and how bold this holographic effect is this wasn't a very intricate or diverse custom it was very simple just tape up the upper tape up the midsole and paint the patent leather um, I did have to do some prep on it but it was a very simple custom very fast and uh, this paint is very effective and just make this shoe pop a whole lot more. So let's go ahead and get into the footage. All right, YouTube. So we have here the uh, Concord 11 Lowe's. I uh, added uh, about four coats of adhesion promoter, the dupe color. That's why the panel is kind of dulled out. But um, I am about to put on the paint. This is the replacement box. Um, just so you guys know, these are authentic. But I'm about to put the paint on after doing uh, one more coat of adhesion promoter and then we're going to start adding our layers. So I just want to give you guys a good little 360 look at it before I start putting on the paint. Okay, YouTube, so here is the finished product. I'm not sure if you guys can see it or not, but the, uh, the holographic effect on these. But, uh, yeah, I had to come outside so you guys get the full effect. The panel leather is shining. They don't have the same effect as when I first did it, just because after putting on the uh, finish, it kind of covered up the uh, holographic flakes. And I'm guessing that this material uh, needs direct sunlight for it to have its best effect. And with doing multiple coats of uh, the ceiling, it actually kind of covered it a little bit. But it still has this glare and that rainbow effect. It's just not as bright as it was without the clear coat or the ceiling. But I just want to come outside so you guys can get a good look at it. Hopefully you guys can see it. Trying to get the best angle as possible. But I am definitely happy with the product. It came out super, super good, super clean. And that's on both shoes as well. And definitely doing multiple coats of that clear gloss finish definitely did the job because it has that pen leather feel and look yeah, these look amazing nice and smooth with because of the clear coat feels like pen leather yeah, these, are, these are clean 